Hello. In today's session, we are going to discuss how to change the password of eOffice. As you know, the uh, eOffice is web-based application and it is based upon the authentication and authorization. For the authentication, it is just background check the user credential which uh, are existing on our LDAP server. The user credential means email ID and password which has been created by the email service provider. Over there, we can just simply uh, click on the email services. This one is the email domain URL through which we can get our email over there. Let's simply click on the sign button. It will get logged in my email services. If in terms of want to change or update the password of your office, we have to change the password of our email. For the uh, context of the changing or updating of the password of email, we have just click on the change password option over there. Just below the user credential tab, just click on the change password app. It will redirect it to the pass app application. Over there, we have to just provide the basic information and through the uh, OTP verification, the password can be easily changed or update uh, in email address tab i just need to provide my complete email address domain name and simply just enter the last four digit of your mobile number which uh, is registered in your email account enter the content over here just uh, a four b u u capital if you have found any kind of difficulty while providing the captcha you can refresh the captcha over there if we click on the refresh button the another combination of captcha uh, will be appeared just click on the submit button why this is not working the uh, mobile number which you have entered is in the encrypted form but just you have provided the last four digit of your mobile number which is registered with in your email account click on the submit button after that a page will be uh, same time the why this is not working A new screen will appear over there in the same way you can also update your mobile number let's just wait why this is not displaying on our screen let's click on the refresh button after that let's see what happened the coverage OTP or OTP send over mobile number uh, a OTP will be sent on, on our mobile number 
and this one is the mobile number last four digit which we can verify our mobile number as well if have any kind of issue you receiving the otp we can reinitiate by clicking on the recent otp sometimes the otp will not received so frequently that's why we just click on the otp button after that just you simply provide the otp over there after that enter the captcha again over there mm, the otp is not receiving tower authentication has been approved uh, it, I just installed the Kavach uh, on my mobile app. That's why it's asking for the Kavach authentication. You can process it by your Kavach authentication or OTP. You just have to write down your new password. It's a combination of capital letter, special character, and number. That one is the policy to set the password of email. You must remember your password special character after that retype the same password over here and enter the image button p g x q b w as i uh, we clicked on the submit button our password will be updated a um, message will also appear on the screen but i am not going to update my password over there that one is the policy through which you can update your password by yourself so just upgrade your knowledge and teach yourself with me i will try to explain every uh, concern or query just do let me know through the comment box i will get back to you as soon as possible